Hi guys. How are you guys doing? Um, this is my third video. I am slowly getting the hang of this. Editing would have to be the hardest thing I would say. But today I am going to do a haul for you. This is going to be um, one part of a haul. Um, this is going to be stuff that I bought for myself and a couple things that I received for Christmas. Um, later on I'm going to be doing I'm going to be doing a full haul on like Christmas presents, mostly stuff that I feel you guys would be interested in or maybe um, want to know about. The useless stuff, you know. Like I know I'm getting a waffle maker, but I don't think I'm going to do a haul about that. <laughs> so anyways, I'll start off with um, some stuff that I got. So the first thing, and the thing I love the most, is this um, 13 inch in case um, laptop case. And it is for a 13 inch MacBook or a MacBook Pro. It is hot pink and it's um, like this shiny material on the outside. And the inside dun, 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 is all white. And I don't know if you could see in the camera, but see this like material? I feel like it's like velvety almost, but not. But it's so soft, like ridiculously super soft. And it protects your computer amazingly. And it's super thick and padded. So seriously, if you drop your laptop, you're in good hands. I mean, don't drop it off a building, but if it drops off your bed, you'll be good. <laughs> So I love this one. Um, I got this as a present, and normally it's for it's like about fifty dollars at like Apple or any like electronic store. Um, maybe actually at Apple it's a little bit more expensive, so I would recommend Target or Best Buy. I don't know. Honestly, I don't know their prices, but this is fifty dollars. Next thing is this adorably wonderful coach bag. Uh, the color is not coming out on this camera, but I got this for my dad. Thank you, dad. Um, it is just a leather coach tote bag, I would say. It has a strap for a shoulder, and then it has a removable strap for um, over the shoulder, which is how I prefer to wear it. Um, I love the size of it. It's like perfect, not too big could fit in the camera. This is about how big it is compared to my head. <laughs> but yeah, super cute. It's like a rusty orange red color, which I love because I have a lot of black and like tan purses, so it's good to have a change. And I think this goes with a lot of um, colors, especially like neutral colors, which like browns like this shirt. <laughs> um, one thing, one more thing I got that I forgot to take out. You guys like my spinny action. Woo, my hair. Anyways, so the last thing I got was from my sister. And um, it's this cute little wristlet. And it has a braided um, band that is removable. It is removable. If I can get it off. Yeah, see, removable. Stick this back on though. Um, so it's the color, it's gray, if you couldn't tell. <laughs> And it was um, $22 from Urban Decay. It comes with um, a shoulder strap, so if you did want to wear it across, you can. And it has pretty much like the insides of a wallet. It has like a credit card holder, um, cash, little zipper for your change. Um, I think this would be perfect for a night out, or it could even be perfect for, you know, like an adventure day when you just when you need only a little purse and your shoulder strap so you don't have to carry it with your wrist. Anyways, I love this too. Thank you so much. Mwah. Um, so I think that wraps it up for what I received so far, which obviously I don't have a lot because it's not Christmas. But now for um, the stuff that I bought myself. I'll start with Bath & Body Works. I always want to call them Bed Bath & Beyond, but Bath & Body Works. So I bought... Um, they had this sale, it was buy two, get one free, and right now I only have the lotions, but I also got this um, body wash, and it's called like Japanese, um, 
Ugh, I can't remember. Japanese something. It's a new fragrance, but it smells amazing too, so I suggest that one. But these two are amazing. They are from the Signature Vanillas, um, Signature Vanillas line, and it is coconut vanilla and ap apricot vanilla, but they are the triple moisture body creams, and they smell so good. Like, this one smells like coconut vanilla. Oh, I love it. I love vanillas and coconuts. So if you don't like that stuff, yeah, obviously don't get this. And the apricot vanillas is perfect because it's like, it's almost like an orange cream bar. It's like that, that little bit of fruitiness and then that vanilla comes in and just like neutralizes it. Oh, I love them. And they leave your skin super soft and moisturized, obviously. Super thick lotions too. So if you don't like thick lotions, these probably wouldn't be the thing for you. See how it's sticking straight up? It's because it's super thick. Um, I think they have regular lotions though in these scents. So if you guys do like vanillas, I would highly suggest these two creams. They also have other signature vanilla scents, but apricot and coconut were my favorite. So next is Forever 21. And from here, I got this kabuki brush. And I've been needing a kabuki brush that works good and is soft because I have been having the worst luck like I had this one and it was fine it had long bristles like this it was all black though and whenever I would go like rub it on my face all these little like hairs from the stupid brush would get on my face and tickle and ugh, I hate I hated it so I threw that one out and so I went to Target and I found one by like their I think it was like a Target brand I got this one, right? But this one feels like sandpaper. Like, ow, when I put it on my face. So, do not get this brush from Target. It was, it was like four, four something, oh, five dollars with tax. But, please, it's completely plain black base. I'm sorry, I can't remember the brand, but do not buy this brush. So anyways, the ones I got from Brooklyn on, super soft, like, ugh amazing like I could do this all day 480 for 21 suggest now I got two pairs of earrings from the dollar fifty um, rack and they are these gold ones and I thought they were just really cute I mean on the back they don't even have the design so obviously they're really cheap but they're dollar fifty so they'll last me a dollar fifty and I'm kind of okay with that. <laughs> the next ones I got were these silver ones. Because I really like dangly earrings. And I mean, you don't need to have the heavy... Like, I like these because they're so light. And my ears are really sensitive. Great. Did I speak too soon? Is it already broken? Oh, no, it's not. Okay. So, these are the other two earrings. Um, super cute. Super simple. Like, I mean, from far away, you can't tell these are $1.50. And I'll take the best care of them. And honestly, if this falls off, it's called tweezers. It's called tweezers, okay? Tweezers. Last but not least, my favorite earrings. These were not $1.50. They're $3.80 or $4.80. I can't remember. But look at these cute-ass earrings. Teal and gold. Love that color combo. Um, they're a little bit heavy, but they, they don't like hurt or anything because my ears are really sensitive so but I love them super cute statement earrings especially if your hair is up and you're just wearing like plain everything else they will just like pop like crazy love them okay um last from Forever 21 are these little black booties these were $24.80 super super cheap um, I don't know if you can see, but they kind of cut down into this V shape or like check, like a check, check and a cash. Um, <laughs> anyways, yeah, so these little booties, they're $24.50. Um, that is obviously a really cheap booty, so obviously you're going to be getting what you paid for. But I have worn them already, and I have no complaints. They're, they're fairly comfortable for $24 shoes. Um, the suede is good. Uh, they they don't get dirty too easily. Um, I would I would say that they're a good buy. 
So yeah, and this, I love this cut. I feel like it just makes your foot look sexy. It's like, it's like an open, it's like a button down with like the collar like open. It's like, it's like cleavage, foot cleavage. Okay, that's weird. Okay, anyways, but yeah, so I got these cute little booties. Oops, wrong feet. Cute little booties, 24, 2480, if I Okay, last but not least, I went to Target, which is Target. <laughs> And I got, oh no, I forgot to show you this. One last thing. I got this from my boyfriend. Um, it's, okay, well, let me show you the front. This is an iPhone case, obviously. But you would think, like, red or green and, like, what? Like, what? Like, ew. But then you turn around, and it's a little snowman. It's a little Christmas case. It's so cute. I love it. Um, obviously, please don't wear Christmas stuff after Christmas I'm gonna have to change it out after that but until then I'd love to show it off like cuz people are like ew what like what's your case and then I'm like oh, snowman frosty hey guys so I think my computer malfunctioned because it completely cut out my target the end target haul so I will be showing that to you really quick. As you can see, I have a change of wardrobe. Awesome maroon polo. No, I'm going to work in about 30 minutes. So I'm going to finish this up really quick. So um, at Target, which is Target. <laughs> I like to call it that. Um, I got just like four things, so nothing special. Um, but I did try my first time buying um, a colored concealer. And the one I bought was um, a Physician's Formula um, Powder Finish Concealer in green. Um, this is the packaging. It comes with a clear cap. Looks like a lipstick. Um, so it applies like a lipstick. And it looks like this. So you just roll it out. I keep it on the, the shortest one for now because it's still long enough to use. Um, but it is really great. Um, I would refrain from making it too long because it could obviously snap just like lipstick. But it is a really, really great concealer. Like, I'll put a little bit on my hand. As you can see, that's pretty green, right? So literally, like, with me just dabbing my finger over the area, which is what I do on my face, um, I use my finger or I use a brush, concealer brush, or foundation brush. Both. Both work. But look, just by patting this in, it pretty much camouflages into my skin here. And if I had red on my hand, you would see that the redness is gone. But um, it works really great, so I suggest this one. Um, it has another product. The Physician Formula has another green concealer that looks exactly like this. The only difference is it's not powder finish. So I definitely recommend um, spending the extra dollar and getting this one because seriously, it's just like so smooth. It's like you don't have it on your skin at all. Um, but besides that, I also got some socks. <laughs> I know it doesn't seem too interesting, right? But they're knee-high holiday socks. They were on sale for $1.40, and I'm obsessed with knee-high socks right now because I love to wear them underneath my boots because they're warm and because they like I like how the top like poke out. So I like to get stuff like like this, for example that um, you can see on top of my boot. So this one has like a little reindeer and some other little patterns that would be like on an ugly Christmas sweater. But these are cute. Um, besides those ones, I also got them in red with the white snowflakes. So cute white tips at the toe and at the top. And as you can see, it was $1.40, yes, clearance. But yes, so super cute knee-high socks, and the last pair I got are just regular knee-high socks, and these ones were $2, um, and they're just in regular gray, which I don't have, so I just bought them. Two bucks for socks, though. That's that's really good compared to, like, other places, you know. Target's... All today, there has been great sales. But um, that pretty much ends my video. So I hope you guys liked it, and I hope you guys like the products. 
And um, stay tuned for my next haul, which is going to be like on all my Christmas presents and whatnot. So, um, yeah, guys, I hope you guys have a great Christmas, and I'll see you after that. Bye!